right, welcome back here. Fun little fact, Albert Einstein, he shares a birthday, which is uh, tomorrow. Is that right, Albert yep. Einstein? 14th. Your 14th? Yep. Okay. Not 14th birthday. Not 14th birthday. No. How old would he be? Uh, 137. Oh, you are very, very good. All Try. right, in light of that, the local owner of the Nutty Scientist, Kevin, is it Slosher? Slosher. Slosher. Okay, yep. close up. No He's got some hair. He's got a cool experiments with us, right? Absolutely. So, we're going to start with a challenge. Okay. All right. Are you Kevin, ready? I don't know about this. I don't know about this challenge. So, okay. here's what we've got. Yes. Um, I'm going to start with an air challenge. So, air what challenge. I want to see is how much air you can actually produce. So, this is going to be a test of your breath. Okay. A breath test. <laughs> breath test. <laughs> a safe and I've never done that before. <laughs> never. I've never done Good. that before. Good. Well, here's your first one. <laughs> That's right. With Nutty Scientist. Whoa, look at so, this. So, this is okay. our scientific way yeah. of how we're going to measure how much breath you have. Okay. So, here's what I'm going to show you. Yes. With please. this bag. Yes. Should I hold it? I, yeah, either way. Okay. You can let it go. go it's fine. Mm -hmm. So, you're just going to get five seconds. Okay. And you're going to get to inflate as much of this bag as you possibly can. Now, I'm going to give a little demonstration. A little puff, yeah. just a slight amount, little breath. Okay? okay? Now, you can't really tell that I've put any air inside of the bag. Right. However, what we can do is we can actually compress this air yeah. down. Uh -huh. oh. oh, look at that! And measure Can't how we... much air was actually coming out of my little puff. Now, All right. here's your challenge. You get five seconds. Not five just one five little seconds. You have five seconds to try to fill the entire bag. Just your breath. Okay? okay. There's a trick to this idea. Well, yeah. we should ask the lawyer to fill up the hot air. Okay, yes. I get it. I get it, Kevin. Now, I understand. We do have, now, I understand. There is a no passing out policy, so uh, please, uh, if you start to get woozy, and okay. I'm going to give you the five seconds by hand. Can I, can I, uh, all right, I, I, I have to, uh, let me just do it. Okay. Right, Come ready? on, breathe. Here we go. Here we go. You ready? Ready? Yep. Ready? Go. Five, four, three, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. I'll give you three. Two, one. Okay, time. Grab onto the end. Okay. Perfect. All right. Okay. Now here's what we're going to do. Go I'm going to give the official scientific okay. squeeze. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's not <laughs> So now, <laughs> okay. this is what you can breathe out in five seconds. Okay. Now, there is a trick. Yes. And what we're going to do is I'm actually going to speak to you about a scientist, yes. pre-Einstein scientist. Oh, my gosh. 1700s, wow. named Daniel Bernoulli. Oh, now, yes. here's the demonstration I'm going to give you. Yes. Bernoulli came up with an amazing principle about fast-moving air. Uh -huh. So, here's what I'm going to do. Okay. I'm going to see what one breath of air fills up my bag. You just did that before, though, right? I did. Okay. Differently this Differently, time. okay. Yep. So, yep. here we go. Keep one going. breath. One breath. Go ahead. You ready? Now. One breath has filled up the entire bag. Now, the look on your face shows me. You know, we had a magic guy on yesterday, uh -huh. a magician. And I will uh, tell you, science can be magical. Now, here's the issue. Look at that. Obviously, my lungs are not filled with this much air. This could not have possibly come out of inside of me. It wouldn't have worked well. Uh -huh. However, this is where Bernoulli comes in. You see, Bernoulli's principle is fast-moving air uh -huh. creates low pressure. Low pressure is an essence of vacuum, sucks things in. And so, was there anything different that I did when inflating the bag versus what you did? Uh, well, you got more air in there. I got more air in yeah. there. Let me demonstrate one more time so you can see. Because... Can I try it? Absolutely, and I'll show you. Can I get rid so, of this air? Empty your air, yep. I get, uh, get yeah, rid of it. I'm getting rid of it. All right. Here, I'll it. actually walk you through it. Okay, here we go. All right, this is uh, Take Bruley. two, Bernoulli. Take two. Yes. Okay. So what I'm going to have you do is yeah. instead of yeah. pulling it up to your face like this, right. what you're going to do is you're going to create fast-moving air away from the bag, which is okay. actually going to suck all of the air molecules in the surrounding area around okay. uh -huh. and fill the bag. So right. a deep breath from about a foot away. Okay, ready? Yep. Now seal it. <laughs> Money. Well, better, much better. Nice. There you so go. So it's by the speed must have something to do it's with it, the right? Speed. So what happens is the as pressure. those molecules are traveling quickly, so it's any fluid, but air that. specifically. <laughs> look at that! Look at that! Uh -huh. look at that. Oh, so yeah, yes, fast moving actually brings things with them. So molecules are friendly. I like, they like do we have anything else real quick? We, we absolutely do. We have time? Here. Here, All right. Here take this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I brought with me something that is at my absolute favorite. All right. We're not cooking anything today, right? We're not cooking anything, although okay, we're uh, making yeah. some fun things. So, okay, good. 
We've got about a minute here. I brought dry ice. Oh boy. Okay. Dry ice. Very quickly. Carbon dioxide. This looks fun. Uh huh. Oh, cold. Can you touch that? No. no. Please oh, do not. No, no, no. Jeez, you're jumping in again. All right. So, what I've got is I've got dry ice. It's yeah. not ice. No. Typically, it's not made out of water. It's made out of carbon dioxide, which is a gas. Mm -hmm. You compress those gas molecules a ton. Lots yeah. of pressure. Right. Get it very cold, yeah. and you get dry ice. Now, dry ice. Cold to the touch. Mm -hmm. Negative 110 degrees. Okay, I you can't do wait. Let's do not want to touch. Let's do it. Pouring hot water. Ooh, nice. What's happening? I saw that at a martini bar not too long ago. <laughs> mm. yeah. Yeah. This is the process of sublimation, and what's happening is oh. we're actually warming the dry ice up, and it's turning from a solid to a gas quite quickly. Now, no liquid. Well, just the water. There's oh, okay. absolutely nothing coming from the dry ice. You see, right. it doesn't. It turns immediately from a solid directly into a gas. Now. Uh -huh. Last thing, okay. we're nutty scientists. Mm. We have to do things on a big scale. Okay. So what I brought with me okay. is Don't spill it. my nutty bucket. Oh. And we have to do this very quickly. Yes. Okay. Very, quickly. very quickly. I'm Here we jumping go. in. Here is my hot water. Oh, okay. Boy. Pouring in. Is there? Uh, oh. Good. Okay. Finally. <laughs> all right. Bucket of dry ice. Ready? Yes. Pour all in. Pour yeah. all. Here we go. Look out. Whoa. Jeez. Hey. Whoa. Look. Oh, whoa, look at that. Whoa, it's, it's, like, cold, a, it's like a concert. It's cool. We have disappeared. Yeah. Whoa, we're done. And that, ladies and gentlemen, wow. is our show. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> look at that.